Hey, hey, hey. Today, let's do place values. Specifically, let's work with tens and ones cubed. Notice, this is a tens rod or a tens stick. How do you know it's ten? Well, if you don't believe me, count for yourself. Looky, looky here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's always ten. Don't have to double check or triple check. A tens rod is always a tens rod. How many is that? Ten. How many is it now? Still ten. How many behind my back? Ten again. How many over here? Always ten. You don't have to count it every time because you know it's ten. And if this one's ten, then you know this one's ten as well. So why would you count them all by themselves one at a time? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That would take forever. You know it's ten. You don't have to count each time. All right. So let's do the first one once you're ready. We have our tens rods here, and we have our ones cubes over here. Now, if I count this, do I count by ones or by tens? That's right, I'm gonna count them by tens because there's 10 in every stick. So it would look like this. 10, 20, 30. How many are right here? There's 30. But now if I'm gonna count these, do I keep counting by tens? This is just one. So I would have to switch to counting by ones. So after 10, 20, 30 would be 31, 32, 33. Now that can be confusing for some people to be counting by tens and then switch to ones. So let me show you a different way to do it. First, I'm gonna count my tens rods and I'm just gonna count the whole rod. Here's one rod, two rods, three rods. Now I'm going to count my ones cubes separately. One cube, two cubes, three cubes. There were three tens rods and three ones cubes, which would mean three in the tens place and three in the ones place makes 33. See how there's a couple different ways to count them? Real World Connection. What's your favorite player's jersey number? And why do players wear numbers anyway? Do you know anyone 33 years old? Do you know anyone older? What's the age of the oldest person you know? Let's try a bigger number, and I'm going to let you go first. Are you ready? Count. How many did you get? Hopefully you said 50. Let's double check. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. And sometimes it helps if you move them to keep track. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. So in our 10 spot, we should have a five, which stands for 50. Now I'm gonna count these. Would I keep counting by tens? No, these are ones cubes. So after 50 comes 51, 52, 53, 54. There's four ones cubes, so four goes in my one spot. Let's count it the other way in case that's the way that makes sense to you. Because in math, we have to find a way that makes sense to us and that we can explain it to others. And everyone's mind works a little bit differently. So let's lay out our tens rods again. And this time I'm just gonna count the tens rods. I'm gonna count the whole rod. One rod, two rods, three rods, four rods, there are five rods. So in my tens place, I have five tens. So let's put a five up here. How many ones cubes did I have? One, two, three, four four individual ones cubes, so I'll put a four in the one spot. Five in the 10 spot, and four in the one spot makes 54. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. Real World Connection. This is a sign for 54th Street. 
What street would probably come next, one block later? This is a clock that says 1154. How many more minutes until it's 12 o'clock? Let's go one more round with an even bigger number, so I need to get more cubes. I'm ready. You know what I just realized? I have an orange tens rod. Can you see that? Hopefully it's not blending with the carpet like camouflage, like you learn about in science. You know, those animals camouflage themselves to stay hidden from predators. Well, don't worry, Mr. Tens Rod. I'm not going to eat you. <sighs> now, I have a lot of cubes out here. Look at all these tens, and I have a whole bunch of ones. Why don't you count them first while I point? Count. <laughs> What did you get? Let's double check. All right, let's double check using our first way of counting. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76. Or we can count the tens rods by themselves and count the ones cubes by themselves. How many tens rods? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven tens rods. And ones cubes are? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six ones cubes. Seven tens, six ones makes 76. Real world connection. This weather person said it was 76 degrees Fahrenheit on this day. Is 76 degrees cold, cool, warm, or hot? This scoreboard says the home team has 76 points and the guests have 46 points. Who's winning the game and why? Thank you for watching and please check out one of our premier episodes they're linked in the description, or you can find them at the Mr. B's Brain homepage. I think you'll find them just as useful and perhaps a little more entertaining. My personal favorites are Subtraction Magic and Addition Game Show. Enjoy!